Today on the Stay at Home Chef, I'm showing you how to make 15 minute Mongolian beef. Skip the takeout and make this super easy dinner at home. I'm gonna start by making some rice. So I have one cup of white long grain rice here. And to that, I'll add two cups of water because ratios for rice are two to one. And then pop a lid on it and let that simmer for 15 minutes while we make our beef. The rice is kind of like a fun little timer while we make our beef because it really is that fast. Our Mongolian beef is ready to eat in 15 minutes or less. You'll need a one to two pound piece of flank steak and flank steak is really cool because you can easily see the grain running through it. That's what these lines are. You'll use a sharp knife to make thin strips cutting perpendicular to the grain. And then slide all of that cut meat into a large mixing bowl. The grain in the meat provides a natural breaking point, so you wanna make sure you cut against the grain to keep your beef from being chewy. Then add in one teaspoon of sesame oil, three tablespoons of soy sauce, and two tablespoons of hoisin sauce, two teaspoons of crushed garlic, two teaspoons of brown sugar for a little sweetness, one teaspoon of red pepper flakes, and half a teaspoon of ground ginger. Then I'm gonna grab some tongs and toss this all together. Once everything is evenly coated, we can head on over to the stove. You'll want a large skillet heated over nice high heat, and then you just add your beef right into the pan. This will brown up and cook super fast because you cut it nice and thin. So just keep it moving in the pan until the meat is cooked through, or you can also leave it medium rare if you'd like as well, which will give you a more tender meat. Should take less than five minutes to get your beef cooked through. This is so fast, I think we may have beaten the rice. We are ready to eat. I'm gonna serve this up over my rice and sprinkle some green onions on top to add a little bit of color. Thanks for watching. You can find the full written recipe in the video description. Be sure to subscribe, like, and follow, and check out the rest of my videos where you can find hundreds of restaurant quality recipes you can easily make at home. See you later.